Kia ora and welcome to Motat Bun. My name's Briar and today we're going to be making a homemade microwave puffy paint. This is a great cheap craft activity to do at home which develops fine motor skills and is a great inbuilt kitchen science experiment. Let's go. To make your homemade microwave puffy paint you will need a bowl and a stirrer, some flour, baking powder, salt, your choice of food colouring, I'll be using two different colours today. Something to apply your paint with, I'm using a Ziploc bag and some paper. Measure one cup of flour and pour into your bowl. Measure three teaspoons of baking powder and pour into your bowl with your flour. Third step, measure one teaspoon of salt and pour into your bowl with your baking powder and flour. You will need one cup of water, pouring half a cup at a time to your batter. Stir your batter and add more water once ready. Keep mixing until it's nice and smooth and limited amount of bumps. You can now add your food colour. You can either add one colour to your current bowl or you can split your mixture to make several colours. I'll be making two colours today. Add a couple of drops to your bowls. Mix in your colours. Now that your paint's ready, you can transfer it into your Ziploc bag or container, however you're going to be applying the paint. Once your paint's in your bag, zip it up and push all the paint down to the bottom of the bag. Squeeze it to the side and you can make a little cut like a piping bag. Now it's time for the fun bit. Grab your paint and see how creative you can get. Now that we've made your awesome designs, it's time to see them puff. Put each of the designs in the microwave for 30 to 40 seconds and watch them puff. Let's go. Wow, it's like my strawberries are now 3D. The great thing about the microwave, it also dries your paint out. On to the next. Well, that's us for today. You've now created your own homemade microwave puffy paint. And don't they look great? Feel free to check out more of Motat Fun and share your creations with us. Thanks so much, bye.